Okay, Trumpets, it's Mr. Omer from South Summit helping you out with scale, what we call scale number eight, what everyone else calls scale concert A major. Your key of, did you answer it? I hope you said B, because that's what's sitting right there is a B. It's a top note as well, B, and I don't see a flat, so it's not B flat, it's going to be B natural. Okay, so... This to me is one of the hardest scales for all of brass because there's not a good pattern in your fingers. There's lots of sharps and we're not used to playing in sharps. We don't play in this key that often anyway. But it's a really good one to learn and uh, here we go. We're going to learn it. So let's just learn it one note at a time and go after we have the little sharps and flats things. How many sharps are we in? Five. F, C, G, D, A, E, B. F, C, G, D, A, E, B. F, C, G, D. So where do we stop? F, C, G, D, A. Five sharps. Notice them, point them out. F, C, G, D, A. Now you may be like, Mr. Omer, only that A hits any of these notes. Yeah, that's not how key signatures work. Even though this F is way up at the top, it applies to that note right there. Okay? It applies to all Fs everywhere whenever we're playing in that key signature. So there are five sharps. That means two notes are not going to be sharped. F, C, G, D, A. E, B. So E is going to be natural and B is going to be natural. Our first note and our fourth note. Fourth note is always the new one that will be natural from now on. So what does that mean? That means the first note is a B. Oh, which B is it? The B natural or the B flat? Well, that would be B flat. We're on B natural. <laughs> That's my lower C, right? That's not that guy because that guy's a C sharp, but I'm close. So here I am with my first note of a B natural. What's the next note? C sharp. That's one, two, three with the fourth valve, third valve kicked out, sorry. Let's add in one more note. We're going to add in the D, but it's not a D, is it? It is a D sharp. What's a D sharp? Well, a D sharp is the same. A D sharp is the same as an E flat. That's two and three. Okay, what's the next note? The next note is going to be E natural. That's one and two. So I'm going to go from two, three to one, two. I'm not going to lift up the middle valve in between. I'm not going to go da, da. That's a waste of energy. Always keep it down if you can. <laughs> Spend some time going back and forth on just those four notes. Up and down. Pause the video now. Do that until it feels comfortable. Then we're going to add an F sharp. Welcome back. Thank you for pausing it. F sharp is going to be middle valve, valve two. So there's my pentascale up and down. Now I just have three more notes to go. What are they? They are G sharp. Yep, because that thing way up at the top is a sharp. We have G sharp. A sharp, B natural. Okay, this is going to be G sharp is the same as A flat, two and three. A sharp is the same as B flat. And then B natural is second valve. taking me down to the F sharp ba da 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 B A sharp G sharp F sharp okay now don't be afraid to write in some fingerings on this one and to use that for a while but it's even better if instead of fingerings you write in note names and you memorize the fingering for those note names and don't be afraid to pull out your handy dandy trusty fingering chart this, there we go, fingering chart. This guy is your friend, and he's also going to help you understand that, like, A flat is G sharp. 
They're the same note written two different ways, okay? So that's how we navigate the sharps. Here we go, the whole scale note. Uh -huh. 